All right, coming up next, we get to this featherweight clash between Bruce Lee and Max Holloway. I'm anxious, man. What a matchup it is, and it's going to be interesting. And it's going to be interesting to see who has the upper hand early. It's going to be difficult to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's going to be the one that's going to control where this fight takes place? Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the kick. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Both guys throwing potential fight enders here in the early going. Oh, beautifully placed in time kick there by Lee. All right, so one minute into the fight, we've got a full-on brawl here, DC. It's great for the fans, not necessarily for the gas tank if this thing goes much longer. Not great for the gas tank and not good for the old doggies. You can't take so many upside the head, somebody's going to sleep. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Attacking the body now, that shot blocked. Oh, made good use of his size there as he lands the flush knee. And he comes through with a big knee. Lee going for the leg kick. He does not connect. Holloway gets caught with that punch. Boom! Oh, straight right! Lands a big right. I'm sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he is on B Street right now. He's seeing tweet birds over the top of his head. If you take a hook like that, you are on wobbly legs. Oh, big knee to the body. How'd he get that one home? Outstanding knee to the body there. He's the taller fighter. Might as well put that size to good use, and he certainly did so though. Yeah, looks a little wobbly on his feet. 